shenanigans. So, clubhouse so, shenanigans. So, so in the, hold on, one mic. Clubhouse shenanigans is in the room, so this is going on YouTube. Man. So, so Wait, what? To be, real, to be real, fall off, Larry. Yeah, I, yeah, we got six more to go. I got six more to go, Larry. I'm definitely not turning off this faucet. Fact. What up, whack? Man. Motherfucker broke in my car tonight, little bastards. No. Oh. That's so oh. me, though. I knew better. I don't never park like that. Motherfucker stole some clothes, my passport. I think they might have got some jewelry when I ain't thought about it. Little motherfuckers. You have insurance on that jury? The dog? Yeah, That's all. Right. Right. He is insurance on it, but hey. I ain't too short, but you know what's crazy? Because earlier, I saw the shit on Instagram. The little niggas ran in Neiman Marcus or some shit and stole, yeah. ran in the Gucci store, right? Gucci. So I told myself, I said, okay, it's bad out here, right? When you start seeing that shit, these little niggas is desperate, right? So that's on me, because I, you know, when it get like that, you can't keep nothing in your car nothing nigga you go shopping nigga you take that shit to the house because they looking like they don't give a fuck what it is man the nigga the nigga well i i guess i had a suitcase back there or something and i looked the nigga went in there and took like it was shoes and shit they didn't give a fuck they, was, they wasn't even dropping they i'm out of war once or twice but i said you know what maybe the nigga needed this shit fuck it but it's like it's bad out here these niggas is paying attention, they watching. Don't keep nothing in your vehicle, nigga, because these niggas is, is bad. And I know it's bad. And I saw it, but I was just procrastinating. <clears throat> I knew I said, you know, let me take my suitcase and shit out, out the car. I just got back from there. I said, I'll do it tomorrow. Shit, it came out, nigga, whole window was smashed. <laughs> little motherfuckers. Well, I, I just seen a, I just seen a video of the I'm gonna know about it tomorrow though, cause my medallion, one of my medallions they got, they got my name on the back of it. So somebody gonna call me tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? Somebody they can't take it to the jeweler. A jeweler ain't gonna touch it. They gonna be like, we ain't that jeweler gonna snitch on. Somebody gonna call me tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna know. When I come tomorrow, I'm gonna know. Somebody gonna say something. They know, they know who shit they got because my passport was in there. So cut them all, I'm going to hear something. A little bad. I ain't even mad at them, though. You know, that's just shit. That's what it is. That's why I tell people, even if you in these ritzy, these ritzy neighborhoods, like I was in Woodland Hills, nigga, that's where they go looking. Because they figure, like, you know, you slipping. Like, you ain't paying it no attention. They ain't gonna find nothing to value in the hood in the car. What are they gonna find? Some CDs or something? To the rich neighborhood, yeah. yeah that's where they gonna go. Real shit. But I just really about ladies. Uh, holidays coming up in the next couple months. You know all y'all do. Stop here, put it in the trunk, stop here. Shit. You basically have mail that shit to the house. And when you get that shit, take that shit home. Say, today I'm going to this store. Tomorrow I'm going to that store. You know what I'm saying? Because if not, they going to really be car hunting. No, you're right. Shit. Yeah, it's called uh, bipping. They mm. do it out here. You can't leave nothing. People been leaving their windows down. Just no, so nigga, they snatched the whole windows. window. Listen, they snatched the whole window. They broke the window. They didn't even break it. They, they like bent that motherfucker down and tore it at the bottom. These niggas is good. Yeah, it was on the side of the car. It's still, it was shattered, but it was still together because of the tent. These niggas is good. If your windows is tinted, they help them. Because it don't shatter. They might have followed you when you was driving. They, seen the park. Shit, bro. Fuck, they just seen the fucking car in the parking lot. Fuck you mean, nigga? They see a G-Wagon in the parking lot. Look, seen a duffel bag in the back seat. Some other shit in the trunk area and went in the motherfucker. They ain't follow shit. They just, that's all it is. They ain't discriminate at all. That's like they see a nice car in the hood. That's all they need. A nice car anywhere. 
Hey. I'm glad I wasn't in that Rolls Royce, boy. Them windows cost. Them motherfuckers cost, boy. I had one of them break before. Mm. Little bastards. I had, a, I had a, 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 a tuffle bag somebody made for me. I got to call that lady, see if I can get another one. Oh, motherfuckers. Maybe I charge to the game, my nigga. Maybe I'm, I'm they, they charging back some of my deal before. That's it. Damn, it's getting bad out here. I want to yeah. break the house still. I don't even break. A lot of niggas ain't keeping nothing in the house no more, though. They didn't slow down on that shit. Nigga come to my house, he's going to be mad in the motherfucker. He's going to take some TVs, some appliances or something. Nigga, I don't ain't nothing in that motherfucker. Nothing. I just seen a video from this guy named La Truth. He posted a video of, I guess, some young was trying to steal from this guy's house. He came up with a shotgun, and I guess the, the young, you know, put a, put a gun out. And he told him, he said, hey, man, he said, I've been where you've been. He said, I know it's hard. He said, holler at me. He said, put your gun down. We can have a conversation. And he was like, yeah, man, I'm just doing this for my little brother. He's like, well, put the gun down. We come inside and have a conversation. He's like, man, you know how tough it is. He said, I know. Come have a conversation with me. So whatever you talking about, whack, you right. No, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, I seen that. Dude had a gauge on Yeah, it. yep, yep. I seen that. No, I just real shit like my nigga, like, see in my community, well, we gonna see you. Because there ain't even no sidewalks over here. So unless these people are on the golf cart and walking their dogs down the street, or <clears throat> they just walking down the street, you ain't got none of that. These niggas over here, they calling the police. They don't give a fuck. They got this whole ring community. Shit be going off. These niggas be reporting all kind of shit. Strange man was parked in front of this address for a duration of five minutes. <laughs> you know, it was to be a nigga in a mail truck or something. They, they don't. It's just these mall parking lots. You know what I'm saying? Any of that kind of shit. They going in it. They going in it. Now, nah, whack you, you, you travel internationally, you know, frequently. What you gonna do about that passport? Because I know that's not that might not uh, be I as. Go. I just gotta go down and get another one. You know, I just headaches because I got visas and shit in there that's good for ten years, like my visa to China and all that shit. Just gotta go down there and get another one. My visa for China, my visa for Russia. Certain bees are spicy. You got to go refile and get them again. You know, which come in handy because I'm in Europe somewhere and a nigga called me for some business in China. I got to get there. Already. I'm clear for 10 years or whatever it is. So, uh, it's kind of shit. Go down there and get all the shit again. Ain't no big deal. Just a headache. Lights. Mine is set back. For the better comeback. Yeah, you know, you gotta charge that shit to the game. You can't can't stress over shit like that. It is what it is. We're in the world, bro. This shit is like a, a, a monopoly. It's like a board game to me. You know, plus, plus, plus. Loss, 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 plus, plus, plus. It's just gonna happen. It's just gonna happen. what it is. Well, the good news is, you know, you, you keep it moving. You got the, the video shoot with tomorrow or the day after, right? No, I think it's late on the day or something. Oh, yeah, well, yeah, this out there. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got that. You got the Troy Ave thing going on. You still making moves. So even if you, you if it seems like you take a loss on one thing, you still win it on this other side, so. Man, shit gonna happen, bro. It's always wins and losses in your life. I don't give a fuck what it is. Shit is going to happen. They hopped into me, and they found, this teacher caught me up. They had my checkbook, and it was at a school by my house. You never know what could happen. 
Yeah, but you still better. You better go shut that account down. That just yeah, I could. I shut it down. Your bank shut but that account down. Switch it up. It was at a schoolyard. That was crazy, though. <laughs> they probably got your information. You be, yeah, you better do what Wax say. It happened a long time ago, though. That's why I said, but that was weird that they threw it in the schoolyard. It was in my car, my checkbook. I mean, oh, I they went in your shit. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they, I, I didn't lock the door, and I was in. You know how you don't push the button on your car? And I said, oh, shit, the motherfuckers. They left the side, the passenger open so they could go in.